Alrighty, so I am here with the newly minted Fall Stars MVP, Royce Lewis. Royce, what did you think about the festivities this past Saturday? Oh, you know, they're great. You know, just getting to meet new guys and uh, play with some new teammates, uh, it's always fun. Absolutely. Now, uh, you showed off the power, not the first time you've done that here in the Fall League. Uh, first pitch in that at bat where you hit the home run kind of fastball 95 low and away had you been sizing up the pitcher as he was facing previous hitters or that was just all thinking that might be coming or that was all just reaction right there yeah you know just getting getting to watch some guys uh during the other at bats prior and uh you know make sure you kind of get your timing down on the on deck circle and uh, that's what i was doing and then i, I noticed that you threw four straight balls to alec bomb battered before me and uh, I was just trying to make sure, it, you know, make sure it does a strike over the middle of the plate somewhere and uh, be on time, early and on time. Got it. Yeah, that game within a game is always fascinating. And speaking of timing, you're able to generate a ton of power uh, and just forward momentum with your leg kick. When did you start having a leg kick like that? Have you tweaked it much over the years or it's been kind of true for you over several years? Tell us about that. Uh, I started really in high school. Uh, it's just something comfortable for me. I, I liked, uh, went to a game, Dodger game. Uh, I believe it was postseason, actually. I can't remember at this yeah. moment. But uh, Hanley Ramirez had a home run at center field, and he had a big leg kick, and it was a grand slam. And uh, I just remember that moment, just something hit me, and I was like, oh, I want to do that. I want to try to get home runs now, and blah, blah, blah. So uh, really sophomore year in high school is when I kind of started that leg kick. And at first, it was just for fun, and it felt comfortable, and I kept just doing it from there. So. Yeah. And then as far as the way your hands work, are you thinking kind of on plane line drive? Are you generally trying to loft? Does it change situationally? What's kind of your thought as far as your bat path goes? Uh, just square ball up every time, you know, hit the ball as hard as I can each and every time and get, give my, uh, give my bat just the best possibility to, you know, have a good one. So, yeah. Uh, You'll take a line drive or a fly yeah. ball doing damage either way. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Got it. And now away from the field, there's only two weeks left here. You're from Orange County, but you just mentioned that you spend your off seasons in Dallas now. Is there? You're obviously working really hard during the off season, getting ready for next year. But is there something uh, <clears throat> away from baseball that you enjoy? A spot in Dallas, or tell us about what you're looking forward to off the field. Uh, just being able to chill for once. You know, just hang out. You know, do some fantasy football. Nice. Uh, just keep watching the games on Sundays. Uh, just relaxing, kind of just being able to talk to my friends, family on the phone and stuff and, um, and in person and maybe go bowling, go golfing a little bit. And you know, that's all I expect to do this off season. Yeah. Relax. How's your golf game? It's pretty good. I shot a 70 the other day and some people were like, oh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. I'm like, yeah, I actually did. Wow. Um, my grandpa went with me. He could prove it. But, uh, you know, the par was 62. Yeah. So it's not like it was all that great, but it, it was good. It was good for me. I don't play very much. So uh, whenever I go out, I have fun with it. Yeah. These you're a fan of the Arizona courses here pretty yeah. top notch yeah we played yeah we played at a course in Phoenix and uh it was pretty well great and now so some quick hitting questions here this is some hard hitting journalism first off favorite <clears throat> cartoon show growing up that you like to watch uh Tom and Jerry Tom and Jerry yeah, Tom and Jerry I used to watch Tom and Jerry a lot Spongebob as well I mean I just uh whatever it was you know me and my sister would just watch it together yeah. at school so. Right. so the classics do you have a favorite movie uh, yeah, Pursuit of Happiness. Pers Great movie. Will yeah. Smith fan Will then? Smith family, yeah, yeah. Nice. Smith I haven't actually seen the new Aladdin. Did you catch that? Him as Not the yet. No, I was trying to get it on the, uh, <laughs> you know, the fire stick or whatever we had, but uh, I was just going to wait till it comes out. So yeah. We'll see. Now, favorite career moment in baseball thus far? Probably just getting drafted at this point. Uh, Give myself an opportunity to play the game I love for a very long time and uh, to make it to the blues. Nice. Uh, favorite athlete who's not a baseball player in another sport? Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good <laughs> question. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I like LeBron. I like Kobe. I like, I like basketball. I like yeah. football as well. I mean, golf, Tiger. Uh, yeah. Man, there's too many athletes. You can pick one. So are your allegiances more with California sports or rooting for Dallas teams now or just kind of favorite players regardless of where they play? Yeah, just favorite players uh, regardless of where they play or if they're on my fantasy team. Uh, I got to root for them. So like DeAndre Hopkins got to start going off this year. Yeah. Uh, that would help me out a little bit. Well, he's shown an ability to do that. Yeah. Finally, how's the fantasy team looking? Good. Are you doing yeah. well in your league? Yeah, I'm doing all right. You know, I'm 3-3-1 I'm three and three and one and I'm 4-2 and two in another. So, yeah. uh, you know, you never know. It's, it's always about luck a little bit here and there and if your players stay healthy so yeah. it's going to continue to have fun with it my friends a lot of other 
uh, minor league players in your league who you're going up against? Uh, they're not here. Yeah, okay. We have some uh, from Fort Myers and from Pensacola Blue Wahoos. Yeah. Uh, so high and double from Twins Affiliates. So Good. Yeah. Well, hopefully we get you some bragging rights winning your fantasy league. Appreciate and it. congratulations yeah. again on winning the Fall Stars MVP and just having a great uh, performance out here in Arizona. Thank you. Appreciate it, Jacob.